Plex emails Joe Mama. I was going to do that, yeah. On November 1st, media hosting service Plex launched Discover Together in an attempt to pivot to become more like a social network. Plex also altered its Week in Review feature so that it also sends users a summary of their friends' weekly activity, including media that they uploaded to their server. What the f***? I says, pardon? The feature is opt out. Oh, yeah. And oh. many users were unaware of the change until it emailed them their friend's viewing history. Holy crap. Are you fucking kidding me? Meanwhile, their mobile app still doesn't autoplay the next video for me on Android. <laughs> The way the, the 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 extent to which Plex has managed to deviate oh. from their original North Star is truly shocking at this point. So, a Who's this is CEO? a public admission of their user data collection practices that, from my understanding. They had previously said were no big deal. Don't worry about it. I mean, you upload all your pirated content here because we would never, you know, share any of this with anybody or log it or anything like that. Don't worry about it. And number two is like, holy sh! If I want to tell someone that I'm watching some cringe, you know, movie from the '90s that's like, you know only redeeming features that it has about half a second said, of Angelina said, Jolie boob in it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The second he said cringe movie for the 90s, I was like, I 100% know where this is going. Uh, to be to be clear, I actually don't consider that to be a redeeming feature in a movie. Yeah. Um, yeah. I was I was just trying to make fun of his favorite movie. I, I it's have, not my favorite movie. I've watched half of it now. We can talk about it after. Okay. But uh, yeah. the point is... How do, you, how do you watch half of anything? I have kids. When you have kids, we'll talk about how you can be interrupted in the middle of a movie. Yeah. And Emma does this. We'll be watching a show. Yeah. And she'll just get up in the middle of an episode. I'll be like, I'm going to bed. I'm like, how do you. <laughs> you don't get to finish. It's like 10 minutes until the end. She's like, no, I'm tired. I'm going to bed. It's like. I want control like that over we, my life. We, yeah, I didn't know. It I am work so for, I, jealous. I have to watch the end of it. It drives me insane. You're eating a meal and you're just like, I'm full now. Okay, yeah, bye. Like, wow. It's, I am done with this project. It is time for sleep. <laughs> um, it's wild. Yeah, anywho. Uh, this is not cool. I, I am seriously considering, you know, going, jumping through the hoops to figure out Jellyfin or something like that at this point. Oh, I, I, like, I just did. No, I can't. I don't. Plex already works mostly. I don't. I, I'm I'm at a point in my life where I don't want to learn a new content management library organization software. I I don't feel like it. I already know how to use Filebot. I already know how to use Plex. I already know how to use all these. Uh, I already know how to use Make MKV. Like I just I know how to use these tools, and this is not the kind of thing that if I'm not making content about it matters to me to spend a bunch of time on and i'm not making content on it because there are literally dozens of us and it's just not a mainstream enough topic for us to tackle on our channel these days so no i don't want to do this i just want plex to not be shit. that's all i want I'm, I'm looking at i'm looking at the ceo's linkedin which is not something i've like ever done before for like I I've, I've 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 never had a company do something and be like I genuinely don't at all understand the motivation. <laughs> so I've 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 checked out their LinkedIn and I I don't know. Comes from you know, What's Cisco bracket computing. Well, it's something that was sold to uh VMware, so I don't know. Okay. I don't know why it has this logo because or maybe it was sold place. to Cisco. Oh no, acquired by VMware. Acquired it says by right VMware. there. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. Strategy and business development security. Well, uh, oops. <laughs> and then president and CEO of Plex for for almost eleven years. 
So the motivation is clearly not coming from him because he was there when Plex was cool. Yeah. The motivation is coming from whoever is giving them VC money and wants to see their user base grow and thinks that alienating their users is a good way to grow the All user base, I guess. So. I can't think of a single person that I know. If they made it opt in, sure. But the fact that it's opt out is insane. Yeah, like honestly, look, I'm not going to lie. I, Actually insane. I have ambitions for the badminton center that are similarly creepy right right here right here I, I i am i am admitting it right now in my perfect world we would you you would be able to basically like social network the crap out of it and if you're like the guy who beat you three times in the last whatever booked a session it'd be like hey your friend of course you would have to actually authorize people to see this stuff yes yeah, so it would have to be opt-in which completely solves the problem. The point is, your bu <laughs> okay. your buddy is has booked a session. Do you wanna do you wanna suit up and and go at it again? You do you wanna try to sound cool? Capture that Pokemon or whatever. Yeah, like I want to gamify stuff. Um, and for that, we're gonna need to to get creepy. I wouldn't even. I don't want any of this data to leave. Do the you want to join? Compet Are you okay, Dan? There's a mouse on your desk. He, uh, this is hilarious. We're going to the producer cam. Uh, Dan, Dan saw a mouse. Hold on. Yeah, I need the mouse. Yeah, I need the mouse for cat TV. Okay, hold on a second. We have my, we have a thing here. Just a second. Just a second, people. Uh, I, uh, one moment, please. You're holding down the fort. Okay. Uh, sure. I, I think Linus should call it something like competitive Q. Or something like that, just to like make it sound kind of cool. Maybe a better name than that. I'm used to names for engineers, uh, but I think he should make whatever that feature is uh, sound cool, so that people want to subscribe to it. I have not personally seen the mouse, so it darted towards me. I'm gonna crawl up my leg. I would do a topic, but I honestly think this is probably more interesting than tech news. <laughs> I'm really sorry. No, 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 that's fine. This is for Linus's I, I, I love that there was like a very short portion of time of fear and almost immediately into, I must catch this for your cats. Yes. That transition was very fast. Wow. You caught one here last night? Oh, we like got mice. It was the bread. It, it, it was the bread. The bread that had been sitting here. That's what attracted them. Because normally we don't have any food just kicking around in the office. Yeah. It would be um, anyway, so I, I had three mice that I caught in my garage when they got into my grass seed. And they were great cat TV. The cats freaking loved it um, so much that I bought like that. I think we talked about it on WAN Show. I bought that crazy yeah. topper for it. Yeah. Unfortunately, before the topper arrived, after I ordered it, but before it arrived, the mice chewed through the old lid on the cage, and the cats have now eaten their TV. So <laughs> I need new TV for the cats. And then Dan found new TV, but then didn't, um, and then just released it outside. You know, I bet it's the same damn one that just got in the same hole. Because uh, unless you take it like 15 kilometers away or something, it'll like find its way back. Anyway, hold on. I, I'm still there's. I'm, I'm just going to get in here and start lifting things up here. Yeah, I have a pokey stick. Oh, okay, cool. I feel like we need to, like, action cam with one of these cameras. Maybe behind the... This is not tape. doing it justice. Can I action cam with the webcam, maybe? Uh, probably not. Probably not? I, uh, Why not? At the back is it cable Hold on, stream. Give me a second. <laughs> this is more important. It is! Amazing. I think we have some live traps over on the other side anyway. If we just put one of them out here with like peanut butter in it or put like a granola bar in it or something, it'll probably get caught and they'll stay alive in there for a couple of days. So maybe we could just pick it up on Monday. Okay. 
What an adventure. Where, where, where uh, I'm not talking? sure where they are. I saw some. I, I know we had some mice over in the lab, so I know there's definitely something there. And I mean, it's, it's okay. You can just, uh, I, I would just do merch messages for now. Um, anyway, uh, he's leaving. I'm not, he's not there. <laughs> anyway, what were we talking about? Do you know how they call it the DLL show? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it's the DLLM show. And, oh, okay. Because LLMs? Yeah. But also mice? Yeah, I get it. It's very funny. Wow. Wow. It's got layers to it. It's just like a, it's an ogre. <laughs> it's one ogre of a reference joke. <laughs> uh, anyway, Plex emailing your mom is dumb, and they shouldn't have done that. They, if it was opt-in, maybe you could make a little, like, movie club that's yeah, automated. And that's you super can cool. See, like, opt-in would be cool. This feature, yeah. if opt-in, would be cool. Yeah, like I would never opt in to get Luke's movies recommended to me because uh, they're shit, so 